What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Adventures of Zach. Gonna go out for a quick ride again today just to get out of the house again. I don't know if you guys can hear the difference in the bike. Something I want to say is you guys are gonna probably laugh because I would laugh too. But just out of curiosity since I was working on the bike and doing some things and I'm a hundred percent aware of one of the problems that doing this can cause and I'll tell you guys exactly what it is so I don't know if you guys can hear my exhaust what I did was I took out the I took out the, uh, the spark rester J just for shits and giggles I'm not gonna lie it's actually pretty damn noisy it's actually extremely noisy. Um, it doesn't sound bad, but in all honesty, it's a little too noisy for my taste. Now on to the negative effect though. Be aware that if you guys do this with the factory turn signals, you will melt your right turn signal. Apparently, so they say. Now, I've read guys on forums saying that They've been running theirs for a while like this and they haven't melted anything. And I've read guys saying that they melted theirs. I've seen guys that melted theirs, you know, in pictures. So just be aware that if you do this, you take the chance of melting your turn signal. You wouldn't take that, um, you wouldn't have that problem if you don't have the OEM turn signals with that curved down tip out it apparently it, the the exhaust just blows right on them so we'll see i mean i'm replacing mine with an it with a drc's integrated tail kit so i don't really give two shits about my oem turn signals to be honest with you i don't give two shits about them um but you know know that you run the risk of melting your turn signal if you do that Yeah, guys, that, that is way too loud for my liking. I had drones really, really bad. Really, really bad. Way too flipping loud. So, I don't know what exhaust to go with now. I'd be curious to know what the decibels of doing this on the OEM is, because that's just fucking loud, man obnoxiously loud I'm curious to know if that's there's no way because this has got a catalytic converter in it there's no way that this thing is louder than a aftermarket exhaust um, but I don't remember Man, I wasn't really paying attention, but I really don't remember if Terry's exhaust droned that bad in the woods. See, I didn't ride his on the road, so I never cruised at 40 miles an hour with his bike. You know, it's not bad right now, but it's, man, it's loud. We'll see how it turns out on the camera. So how's everybody doing with this coronavirus thing going on? Hopefully you guys are all safe. Hopefully you guys are all healthy hopefully you guys aren't like locked out not locked out but locked down who that is noisy man I don't like that One bit. But I'm so used to my bike being so quiet. It's like it's crazy, dude. Yeah, let me know how it sounds. You ready? How's that sound? Awesome. It does? Yeah, it does. All 
night guys so it's a little little obnoxious for sure <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Did it? Yeah. I felt mine falling in at the end. I thought you were just like, yeah, I don't give a fuck. I'll just go through it. So then you get, yeah, then you're stuck in it. <laughs> Do a small front cam recording. Since then I have my GoPro. Pretty slick right there. I don't know how the stabilization on my phone is gonna be, so it's probably gonna be pretty rocky back here, pretty bumpy. And I probably won't even use this footage. This is just because I broke my GoPro mount. Gotta fix it when I get home. I literally flung shit on my neck. Uh. 